Hey guys, I am back for another track guide. Today we're at Oran Park GP in the Global Master MX-5 fixed setup. Haven't moved the brake bias. The weather conditions are as they're meant to be for this week of racing. Uh, best of luck to you out there. I hope it goes really, really well. Let us know how you're getting on in the comments below as always. If you like the video, please do give it a like. If you want more of this kind of thing, please do consider subscribing. And if you're feeling particularly flush this week, then please do consider buying me a tasty cup of coffee to help fuel my practice laps for next week's guides. Cheers, guys. Have a good one. All right, guys, here we go with my 1 minute 14.988 here at Oran Park GP in the Global Master MX-5. Uh, weather conditions are bang on and the uh, brake bias is the same, obviously fixed setup. So we're keeping the car as far over to the right hand side as we can on approach to turn one. We're looking for the end of this green wall here and just after the end of it, we're going to quite leisurely turn in and we want to get pretty tight to this inside curb here and we're kind of facing out towards the outside of the track now after the curb we're going to ease into the brakes and the idea is we're going to come down initially to second gear and notice this slow um, arc on the brake normally you'd want to brake pretty hard in a heavy braking zone but because we're effectively needing to do a little bit of weight transfer a little bit of steering just to get ourselves in this position which is straight on on the outside of the track we need to ease into that brake uh, so we're down to second and we're going to turn in imminently and then come down again so we're now coming out of the brakes we're using that shift in weight to help the car rotate we don't have to steer massively around there and then we're coming back over to the left hand side of the track and we're looking towards the end of this curb here. And then once the car is on the curb, we're going to brake heavily down into first gear. And we're waiting for the end of the curb to turn in. And again, we're using that release in the brake to get that rotation in the car. And we're back onto the outside of the track. A tricky right hander coming up here. Basically, after the end of this tyre stack, uh, we're going to turn in. We're braking initially. We're going to come down to first. We're not going to brake for long. And we want to tip the car in. And then we're going to catch the inside of this curb. Hopefully not actually hit the curb. And get back out on the gas again. And we're up through the gears. Up onto the bridge. And then just before we hit the bridge... We're going to come out of the gas, tip the car in quite aggressively. We want to get right tight to the inside and then we know we can floor it on exit up to third. But before we reach this little bit of curbing on the left, we need to come. We need to use a bit of brake. We're going to come down to second. And we're going over a crest here so the car can get unsettled. So we want to do an initial bit of steering before the crest and then correct over the crest. And then back into the gas, 
really aggressively onto that inside piece of kerb there so that we can pretty much straight line it over the next corner. And then at the curbing here, we're going to break again down to second and really, like the last one, aggressively attack the curb on the inside, get back on the gas really early. Quite a lot of exit curb here, but when the tyres are cold, you've really got to go easy around there. So we've got a, a blind crest here. Um, uh, so we want to follow the curbing on the right up over the hill and that will lead us ni nicely uh, into the next curb. And we want to get the car over onto the right and we're looking down towards the bottom of the hill here. We've got this patch of dirt and we've got this uh, convenient X mark in tyres, tyre marks here on the right hand side. We're using that as our braking marker. We are going to come down to first. You can do it in second, but I always find you get a little bit more rotation in the car in first gear. It wants to steer more um, and it's actually that little bit faster. So it's worth coming down to first here, in my opinion. So we're braking heavily. We're down to first. We've got to really make sure we rev that engine, get tight to the inside of the curb. We need to we need to really blip the throttle when we're coming down to first. Otherwise, the car's going to get really upset with us. Uh, and we want to be tight here. We're full into the gas now. We've got nice rotation in the car. And we're using all of this exit. That's actually for the pit road, but this is perfectly fine. We're not going to get an off track. And that brings us to the end of our 114.988 here at Oran Park GP in the Global Mazda MX-5. I've, I hope you found this track guide useful. Uh, please do let us know how you're getting on in the comments below. Give the video a like if you like it. Subscribe for plenty more of this kind of thing in future weeks. Uh, and if you're feeling really generous, uh, please do consider buying me a coffee. There's a link in the description below. Have a great week, guys, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.